Hi, Malcolm McGrath, cabinet maker, and I'm going to talk a little bit about the lean concepts of 5S and 3S. Um, 5S was an idea that Tachi Ono, the lead engineer from Toyota, came up with when he was designing the Toyota production system. And essentially, it was a procedure for eliminating waste and making it more lean. 5S's were uh, sort. So sort out what you don't need, get rid of the things you don't need. The next one was set in order, so put everything in its proper place. And then shine, which is just cleaning. Standardize, which in a simple way is just find a good way to do things and stick with it. And then sustain. Some companies, they decided that that was a little bit complicated to remember and also it was a little bit redundant. So they came up with the concept of 3S because they said, you know, really, Sorting and setting in order are the same thing. Instead of just having sort and set in order, they said just sort. And the idea of sustain, if you're sorting and you're setting in order and you're shining, you're really sustaining as well. So they said, let's just do three S's. So the three S's are sweep, sort, and standardize, uh, which is basically just a simplified version of five S. Sweeping is obvious, that's clean all the time. Anytime you got spare time, keep the place clean, tidy up after yourself. The importance of cleaning is you make the place safer, uh, you don't lose tools, you're everything, you know where it is, um, and also you can see problems which you, know, you wouldn't notice if you didn't clean up. Sorting means whenever you're emptying the truck or whenever you're doing your cleanup, throw out what you don't need, throw out the garbage, put things back in their proper place, just get rid of what you don't need. Sort it out and, and make sense of it. For example, this is our shim uh, basket or bucket. This goes in the truck, this is where we carry all our shims. And at the end of each project, uh, you need to take it out and sort through it and reorganize everything. And the important thing is throw out what you don't need and make sure that you have everything you do need. And it's something you need to do throughout the truck. Basically at all the workstations, whenever you're finished a task, whenever you're putting things away. Sorting is one of the regular parts of 3S. So some of this is garbage. So throw out the things you don't need. So for this bucket, we have a checklist for cleaning the truck. And here's one precisely for the shims bucket. And not when you're sorting, you go through the checklist, make sure you've got everything as you put it back in. That way you always have what you need and you get rid of anything you don't need. Now, sorting applies not only to the workstations and the bins in the truck, it also applies even to our storage areas. This is a storage area for occasional use stuff, but every month or so I go through there and anything that I'm not gonna use occasionally, uh, if it's something I haven't used in a couple of years, I just get rid of it. I had some good table saw stands, but I never use them, I don't wanna store them. As I've said to some people, I'm in the cabinet business, not the storage business. A final crucial part of 3S is to standardize. And standardizing sounds complicated, but really what it means is just find a good way of doing every task and stick with that way all the time. And find a way of making sure that you stick with that good way of doing it. So this is, for example, a model of one of our standard lower cabinets. We always use three-quarter material. We always do a European frameless cabinet. We always have standardized legs. We have a standardized layout for these. This little mini cabinet, I mean, you know, in real life this would be bigger, but this is a standard cabinet design. So anytime you're doing a base cabinet, you know exactly what it's gonna look like. It's always the same and it makes it easy. And we've got the features labeled on this little sample which sits in our assembly area. So if you have a question on how to assemble a base cabinet, it's always the same. Another form of standardization is all our cordless tools are Makita. And the advantage of that is that we only have one battery format. They, of course, Makita has a, a 12 volt and they have an 18 volt. Uh, but we don't have you know, DeWalt or Milwaukee, or we don't have 10 different battery companies, each with their own format. You know, we can exchange the batteries from any of the, the drills that are on the shop or on the site, and they're always the same, so you're not mixing and matching batteries and chargers. So that's another really good form of standardization. 
So that's 3S, and you should really practice 3S basically every time you clean up, doing your tidy up, and on a regular basis.